I know you all love to use iMessage. But what if I tell you I've got plenty of tips and tricks that you've never used and if you start using them your iMessage game is going to go up a level. Interested? Let's check them all out. My name is Lakshay. You're watching iGeeks blog and let's get started with today's video. My first trick for you today is if you want to make your messages look bolder. Now WhatsApp allows a lot of customization. You can make your text bold, you can italicize it, you can underline it and what not. Unfortunately, you cannot do so much of that on iMessage, but you can still make your messages look bolder. And how exactly you can do that? I'm going to tell you. All you have to go is dive into the settings, go to the messages app, enable show subject field. Now open the messages app and open any conversation and you will see a subject field over your message. Make sure you type your text in this subject field to make it look bolder. Now the tip here is you have to keep the subject field populated as well as the message populated because if you don't populate the normal text field your subject will not look bold. Now that was pretty good but my next tip is even better if you want to customize your i messages even more if you want to send them with that added emphasis with an added character this is all you have to do Here's a surprise just write pew pew in your i message chat box and watch the magic happen or you can write congratulations and see the bubbles and the balloons come up on the screen want more of these just type your message long press on the arrow and wait for all of these on screen effects full screen effects for your i messages it looks amazing in all of your conversations and adds a lot of value there The next tip is if you want to share your live location on iMessage. Now we all love the fact that we can share our live location on WhatsApp, but if you lament the fact that you cannot do so on iMessage, well my friends, you are wrong because you can do that even on iMessage. All you have to do is open a conversation. Now tap the person's name from the top. and to share your live location tap on share my location and choose the time you want to share this location for this can be an hour or till the end of the day or till as long as you want it to now your live location is visible to that person even from i message no need to open whatsapp to share your location tip number 4 and this is how you can delete multiple messages in a conversation i message is not known to be the most flexible messaging app out there but it still got some nifty tricks up its sleeve and this is one of them on whatsapp it is pretty easy to delete multiple messages through just long pressing them and selecting them and pressing delete they are all gone but on i message there are some extra steps you need to take and that is you just open a conversation you tap and hold on a message press more and from the left edge tap on circles and select all the messages you wish to delete At the end just tap on the trash icon and delete the number of messages that you have selected. Now all of these messages are only gone from your iMessage chat not from the other person's one so make sure you cannot delete the messages for all of you but you can delete them from your iPhone. Tip number 5 and this is a big one. We all know that Apple allows us to react to iMessages through these tap basic figures you know the hearts and the likes and the thumbs down and the question mark and what not. What if I tell you you can react to certain messages even through your memojis and animojis? Never thought of that one, did you? Now I'm going to tell you how. Just open a conversation. Now open your memoji and long press on any memoji or animoji that you want to share with and just drag it to the message you want to reply it with. And you're all set. You can place these animojis or your memojis on any message and react to that one with them. Pretty straightforward, right? But not a lot of people knew about this, and that is what makes this even more interesting. Because when you do this, the other person will get really confused and ask you, "Hey, how did you do that?" 
and you can share this knowledge with them and make sure you share this video with them as well because these are the five amazing incredible iMessage tricks that not a lot of you know about. And that was it for today's video. Make sure you hit the like button and subscribe to iGeeks blog and turn on notifications for all of our videos. I'll see you guys in the next one.